Hey guys, today is uh, psychosis by definition, schizophrenia and psychosis by definition. But before we define psychosis, please allow my brief prelude. As you know, I've conveniently recorded it for our mutual comfort, our mutual convenience, and our mutual luxury. And hey, listen, I'm no spring chicken. I'm cool with that. And I've been around a few uh, preludes in my years, and this one is particularly luxurious. Uh, much like a, uh, what, a uh, Toyota Corolla, of course. Hello there, my name is Robert Francis. You stumbled on my luxurious. Unconquering Schizophrenia YouTube channel. Automobile. Where me and the bird. Yes. That's right, that's right. We talk schizophrenia. That's Mike. This is the cut of my jib right here for reasons of my medical confidentiality. Indeed, indeed. I'm a licensed clinical social worker times 15 years. Indeed, indeed. That's a lot of gabbing and chatting. I've been diagnosed with schizophrenia for a score five and one. And that puts a little gray fleck in my beard. Indeed, indeed. Thank you for joining me on my channel. Now to topic, to topic, to topic. So uh, psychosis by definition is uh, being detached from reality. But what does that mean? What does that mean being detached from reality? How do you, how do you know? How do you know? Well, from my estimation, most people, um, all people, kind of live in two worlds. We live in the world between our ears and we live in the world between each other. And uh, the one between our ears is uh, unique to each. And for us with schizophrenia, it can be, um, our thoughts can be uh, outliers oftentimes. But uh, the psychosis definition comes from the shared reality, the social reality that we share. And when we break norms and uh, say things out of context and ask, uh, uh, act uh, irrational uh, socially uh, over time and um, consistently, then a psychotic um, designation can apply. So, so psychotic, psychosis by definition really is in regards to the social reality. It's not necessarily just the reality between our ears. And so it is. You can think whatever you want, uh, as long as you behave accordingly in the social environment, then the psychosis will not be apparent. And so, despite outlier thoughts and strange ideations, if we act apart in the social realm, we're golden. So, uh, the Toyota Corolla is a very uh, luxurious automobile. Uh, very luxurious, don't you think? The Corolla? I've never owned a Toyota. But let me tell you, I'm about uh, ready to uh, sign a new lease, a three-year lease on a, uh, on a new car, and that's coming up real soon. And um, I'm telling you, I'm getting uh, antsy on ice because three-year commitments, not my style, <laughs> not my style. I take it by day, day by day. But, you know, three-year lease, uh, that's a long time. That's a long commitment to my car. All right, guys, that's it for today. Uh, thanks for joining me. Uh, Mike the Bird, he's uh, heading to Anchorage uh, for some time off. He's uh, going to join some uh, of his crow friends up in Anchorage for a big seed party. And uh, we'll see you next time on the Unconquering Schizophrenia YouTube channel. Thanks a bunch, guys. We'll see you next time.